Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a follow me around day in my life type of video. I'm currently about to head out to go to a photo shoot and I'm really, really excited about it. It's probably the biggest like photo type of project I've done. Normally when I do photo shoots with people, it's just me and the photographer, but I believe that there's four of us total coming to this shoot today. There's me, a photographer, a videographer, and then we partnered with a local boutique for the shoot, which was really, really exciting. Um, so I wanted to just kind of explain the day and take you guys along with me. I was hoping to be able to start this video a little bit earlier in the day, but my work kind of ran late and I just like came home and kind of rushed and got everything put together so as you can see I'm just in a sports bra I need to change I'm getting ready to head out the door like I said it's about 4 p.m. I need to leave by 4 15 like absolute latest to get there on time so I'm getting ready to run out the door so that I'm not late but I wanted to give you guys like a sneak peek of the outfits and kind of a quick insight to my day and I'm super excited to bring you guys along with me so this is the bag that I'm packing up to bring with me to the shoot and then these are the three pair of shoes that I'm wearing. Normally I just wear one, but all of these looks are kind of different today. So I'm bringing three different pairs. And then over here, I just have my straightener and a brush. I'm not sure if I'll have a spot where I can like plug in my straightener and touch up my hair, but I figured I'd bring it just in case. And then I just have a makeup bag. It's pretty basic. It's just got like concealer and stuff like that if I need to touch anything up. This is the first look that we're shooting. So this is a little sneak peek. It's just this slouchy t-shirt with some distressed shorts and a bralette. And then I have this little bag that I'll be carrying with me today. I have this really, really cute romper. I think this is the first one we're actually shooting in. So I'm gonna change into this in a second with some necklaces in there. And then this ring, cause I'm not sure exactly which outfit I'll wear this with yet. And then the last outfit is this beautiful kind of midi maxi style dress. It's like a dark navy color with flowers, as you can see. And then these are the necklaces that are going with it. I have my camera because I'm going to be vlogging today. I'm not sure if I'll be able to use my camera versus my phone, but I'm bringing it just in case. And I think that that is everything that I am bringing. here now with Julia and William if you guys want to plug your channels and um Julia Fay Photo, JuliaFayPhoto.com based so, out of Charlotte based out of Charlotte uh, mine is the projects on YouTube and Instagram and we're hot and sweaty yeah so. it's very hot out here but we just finished at our first location which is this cool like how would you describe it well, like rustic-y, very rustic, very warehouse vibes. Yes, 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 yes. Very trespassy vibes, but yes. we ain't afraid. It's all good, it's all good. And the photos are looking awesome. Yep, and I have this romper on with the beads and the choker that I showed earlier. And now we're gonna go ahead and go to our second location and change outfits. <laughs> Ready to descend, girl? Do you want to go first or do you want me to? I think I need to go first. Okay. Because I don't want to be left up here alone if I don't That's go down. That's true. Wow. So we just finished up with our second location where we, as you saw from my very dramatic video, climbed up the fire dramatic. escape. Hey, me. <laughs> Never. Okay. Don't know what you're talking about. And we are going to our third, third, yes. fourth, third to the fourth. Third so, to the fourth location. Yeah. Going a little bit more casual now. No more heels, no more climbing. And we're feeling good, right? True. Just kidding. Feeling good? Feeling great. Photos look awesome. They're gonna be so worth the blood, sweat, and tears. No blood yet, and just dirt. for the record. You're here very much dirt. Mine are. Yeah, mine are. <laughs> so we are at location three, or an attempt at location three. The first place we went was closed. 
The second place we went was closed, so we found this place that's 100% closed, but it's open, and this is our attempt. We're gonna go find us a prop, is what we're calling it, and we're both there, Steve. Yes, something yeah. cold. Something cold and something to hold. What does it say? It says, back in 10 minutes, maybe 11. I wonder when the popsicle place you wanted to go to is closed. You go to plan B. I think I want raspberry lime, but I'm also. So we just finished wrapping up all the photos. We ended with the popsicles that you guys saw us get from a convenience store because the popsicle <laughs> store was closed along with every coffee shop within the area but I'm really excited to see how they turned out she did a wonderful job at taking photos thanks for rolling with the punches and he did a great job taking video over here it's not the best angle I'm sorry about that one and yeah I'll probably finish up this vlog when I get in the car later but great job <laughs> So I'm obviously back home now and I just wanted to take a second to kind of debrief on the day and explain everything like that. Um, as you guys saw, I just got back from a photo shoot with Julia and William and it was so much fun. They were so sweet and I felt very like comfortable with them immediately. Like you probably saw in some of the clips I was being like very sarcastic and just like kind of witty with them, which I feel like I'm not normally that way, especially on like photo shoots or the first time meeting someone. I'm very like just like calm and nice, you know, but I felt like I could be very like sarcastic and funny with them. Um, and it was just a really, really great experience and I feel super humbled that they were willing to work with me and like I said, all the clothing in this video was provided by Boho Blue, which is a boutique in North Carolina and it's just such a company that is near and dear to my heart. So I forgot to mention this in the video, but Boho Blue is kind enough to give me a discount code for you all. So if you'd like, you can use Amy10 for 10% off your purchase. And again, I'm just so humbled and filled with so much like, gratitude that these brands were willing to work with me and that they think that my content is high enough quality to represent their brand and vice versa. And it's just a really, really crazy thing that I'm able to do. And I wouldn't be able to do that if you guys weren't watching my videos and liking my pictures on Instagram, things like that. Um, so I just wanted to say thank you for your support because these opportunities are really, really cool for me and I don't take them for granted. And I don't know, I just, I feel really lucky to have these opportunities and be able to work on projects that I'm super excited about like this and can be creative. Eventually I'm gonna start rambling here. I think I already have but I just wanted to come here and kind of wrap up the day and say how great of an experience it was and how lucky I feel to work with Julia, William, and Boho Blue. I will leave links to everyone and everything down below. I will link as much of the clothing and jewelry as possible from Boho Blue down below along with Julia and William's Instagram pages and any contact information. If you guys are based in North Carolina or you're traveling, Boho Blue has an online website. You can just shop that regularly. Um, I would definitely recommend reaching out to any of them. They are all incredible, incredible people and brands and companies. I'll also have my Instagram down below if you want to see some of the photos from the shoot. They should be up by now by the time you guys are seeing this. If not, they'll be coming out soon to so just like follow it if you um, want to see the final products. And yeah, I think that that is everything and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye.